So there's a present to you from the end of the over boys who are just down in front of us, the Naga Chilies. And they suggested I give one to Kerry while he's on air <laughs> and see how that <laughs> <laughs> goes. Asha. <laughs> You're listening to Grandstand's ball-by-ball -ball coverage of the Aussies taking on India, live from DSCG, on your home of cricket, ABC Local Radio. The Naga boys. Do you know them? No, I'll tell you what's the best thing about these Naga chilies in a minute. As Ishan Sharma bowls and Clark lets it go through. There's a zip snap lock on them. Yeah? So that's a deterrent. Keep them fresh. I would venture to suggest that if you had a Naga chili, I would have yeah. to do commentary for the next 20 minutes all on my own. Really? <laughs> Give me one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Do you want do you want the one do you want the one that's red and slim? Or do you want the one that's <laughs> yellow and round as Ishan Sharma runs in? He's tall and slim. And he bowls from over the wicket to Clark, who gets behind the line and pushes out the cover. Australia haven't lost a wicket yet. No. Or oh, wow. do you want... It's a Glenn McGrath. He will bleach one of these chilies for you. Okay. Wow. When you bleach red, you get pink. Actually, I'll tell you what. I'll give you the yellow because I'm told that the long, slim ones like, are the most dangerous. So Is it Naga N-A-G-A? I hope so. Yeah. I, I've played in golf in golf uh, events where you get the naga. You know what it stands for? How would I know, Kerry? Not a golfer's <laughs> ankle. Up comes <laughs> Ishan Sharma and Bowles, and uh, Clark lets it go through outside the offset. I must confess, Kerry, this is the first time I've been on radio, yeah. and I get the feeling I'm in a hall in front on of a the live stage. audience. <laughs> <laughs> you get a lot of backs, but occasionally you get faces. Mm -hmm. No, they're terrific up here, top of the... What are they going to do next year when it's a rub? We'll have to have temporary stands. I'll tell you what they won't do next year. What? Once you've had this Naga, Naga. chili, they won't send you another. <laughs> <Naga>. <laughs> There's a slip in a gully. Deep point, no third man. Cover mid-off and a short cover. Mid on mid-wicket and deep back with square leg as Ishan Sharma runs in from the pink sponsor sign and runs into ball to Michael Clark. And Clark is beaten as he plays a defensive shot. Is looking to cover the movement. It was late and the ball left him outside the uh, outside the off stump. You going for it? I'm not going to try it, mate. No? Nah. Aussie? Nah. When was the last time I saw an Australian chickening out of a challenge? But it's... It yeah, <laughs> they want me to have a crack. I <laughs> know. <laughs> <laughs> you fools! No. <laughs> I won't get wages. No, I'll tell you something else though. When you when you when you get the long slim chilies, I come from the land of chilies, yeah. so I know a thing or two. I don't know these, but these these look more like capsicum, which are uh, sort of uh, okay. sort of diluted more more for the Australians. As uh, Clark goes forward and uh, drives the next one out on the offside. He's gone through a lot of landmarks already. He's on 258. Yeah. He's gone past Ponting's 257, which is the highest score by an Australian against India. He gets to 281. He'll be the highest in India-Australia test matches. Australia, meanwhile, are 511 for four on a lovely day at the Sydney Cricket Ground. It's a day made for eating Naga chilies. <laughs> <laughs> There's some water here, too. No, I'm not eating no. it. Uh, no, no, I'll tell you what, you might need this. I'll keep it handy. <laughs> no, no, I, I, I'm sorry, Harsha. I, I don't know anything about chilies, but I know that there's danger. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. <laughs> I think you need a slow hand clap. <laughs> Go, Kevin, come on. <laughs> no, oh, look, out there. <laughs> Oh, dear. Oh, Mick, and, uh, Mick Clark's 258 <laughs> not out. Pr he'll probably get out. Oh, they think I'm batting too slowly. Ashwin is bowling from round the wicket to the left-hander with a slip and a silly point. And uh, Hussey is down the wicket. He does use his feet very well. <laughs> and it's played out to cover. He can't get it on. Now, Ashwin comes from the state of Tamil Nadu. He comes from Chennai. Oh, yeah. Tamil Nadu. Formerly yeah. called Madras. Okay. And in England, there's something that you never eat in India. You never get in India. It's called chicken Madras. 
Okay. As Ashwin bowls and uh, Clark uh, Hussey goes forward in defence, we don't know what a Vindaloo or a Madras is. You don't get chicken Madras, eh? But he would eat very spicy food, yeah. and you would fall enormously in his eyes if he discovered that you were shying away by the look from the look of a chili as Ashwin bowls and uh, Hussey goes forward. You're a defense. tricker, Hashi. You're trying to trick me into it. No, I'm just you telling you straight up front. No, no, yeah. I'm being very Aussie. I'm telling you straight up front. Yeah, if you're fair dinkum. I'm, I, I even know what fair dinkum means. As <laughs> Hussey comes down the wicket, drives on the offside. I don't trust you, you skinny little thing. <laughs> four, 512 <laughs> for four. Tenacity, I'm told, is one of my qualities. Is yes, it? So you can call me yeah. all the names you want. <laughs> no. Well, later on, perhaps. We'll get through the first session. No. <laughs> no, no. What are you, Eve? Tempting with a, an, a yellow apple. Ashwin bowls and uh, Clark goes forward in defence. If I was Eve and you were Adam, we'd be in danger. <laughs> <laughs> the world wouldn't have started. Yeah. Ashwin goes round. I hate round you in weekend. blue. <laughs> And Clark pushes out on the offside, and Sevag will trot behind it. He'll keep the scoring down to a single, but single was all that was on anyway. Clark goes up to 259, and Australia now 513 for four. I wonder when they when they'll believe they've uh, they've got enough. Maybe bat on to to tea time. When you were a, when you were a batsman, yeah, were you scared of fast bowling? I, I didn't like fast bowling. Were you scared of it? Um, if people slow hand clap to you, would you go and say I'll bat, like you're shying away from the chili? Uh, no, no, no. Uh, but even with a helmet on, I, I wouldn't be having a crack at that chilli, I'll tell you now. A uh, helmet's got nothing to do with the, <laughs> with the <laughs> taste buds. <laughs> no, it's not. No, you're, t you're tempting me too much. But I tell you what, I, 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 I'm interested in uh, the fact that Michael Clark is, is, is laying such a strong platform for his own innings today. Uh, yesterday he was sparkling along, but it, it, he's a lot more circumspect this morning. But he didn't strike with just a slip and a wideish, deepish gully to Clark, who's pushing out on the offside. He'll take a single out to deep point, and he'll go up to 260 Australia, 5144. Okay, last point before we change the topic on the Naga chilies. Yeah. I've cut a little portion out for you. Mm -hmm. So you've got only a little half millimeter worth to eat, but you can smell it first. Yeah. Go on. Mm. Oh, no. No. Why? No, no, that, that is. Uh, okay. Okay. That that could uh, just just to induce shame among all Australians. I'm actually going to have a little piece. Are you going to have a piece? Yes. Go. And that's minuscule. That's all I'm offering you too. Okay. I thought yeah, yeah, go. Ish Ishan Sharma, with now to the left-handed hustle. I love it when you talk hot. <laughs> and he lets it go through, outside the offside. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Oh. Anything? What do you got? <laughs> How's your tongue? Water boy. Medic! <laughs> Medic! The commentary for a while. <laughs> I've switched the button off, gone for a while. Could Dr. Jones please report to the ABC box? Ah. <laughs> Can we get. There's Ishan oh. Sharma. And he's bowling to Hussey who pushes on the offside for a second. Oh. Uh. Naga Jalokia, Capsicum Chinense is also oh. known as Bhut Jalokia, B Jalokia, Naga Morich, Raja Mirchi. It's been certified by a number of independent <laughs> tests and by the Guinness Book of Records as the hottest chili in the world. <laughs> <laughs> At a little over a million scores. <laughs> yeah, well done. <laughs> it has the same heat level as many of the extreme hot sauces that have distilled chili extract in them. Oh, <laughs> it looked hot. Oh, Ishan Sharma, hottest chili in the world. And after this ball, it's going to be Jim Maxwell, I think. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> it was nice working with you.